I'm Jim Berenson. I'm the medical and scientific director of the Institute for Myeloma and Bone Cancer Research in West Hollywood, California. I have exciting news. We have a very new approach to treating myeloma. We've figured this out over the last few years based on work we've done on drugs known as JAK inhibitors. They block a pathway which is instrumental in leading to myeloma growth and the evasion of the myeloma cells from being knocked out by the immune system. We've been looking for the culprit, that is the protein upstream of the JAK pathway that may drive this process, and we've uncovered it. We've shown this protein is highly expressed in myeloma patients, both in their blood and more importantly in their bone wear. Whereas normal patients have very little of it and patients doing well with myeloma have much less of the protein than those among patients doing poorly. We've moved on to show that this predicts outcomes for patients so that those with higher levels do more poorly than those with lower levels. This has led us to develop the ability to block the protein's expression and show first in the test tube and then in animal models containing myeloma that this gets rid of myeloma. As a result, we've now developed a compound called IMBCR301, which both in the test tube and now in multiple animal models can wipe out myeloma. This is very exciting news and has led us to develop a series of other analogs which are now being developed to test. We find this very promising and exciting. We appreciate your support for this project, and I think this is going to lead to a whole new approach to myeloma, and I think that's the best news. I want to thank all of you for the tremendous response you've given to us from the video that we reported on our recent findings of a new possible treatment for myeloma. The number one question you've all had is, when can I get this? When is it going to be in clinical trials? Well, that's a process, and we have to do certain steps, and we've gotten several of them done. Got to identify the target, check, got that done. Then we found ways to block that target and show that that knocked out myeloma. And then we began to construct compounds, which would hopefully eventually become drugs that would be able to be used for patients. We've shown those drugs can knock out myeloma and also seem to be safe in mice growing human myeloma that we've tested so far. Check that off. But the next steps also need to be completed. We need to find the best drug that also seems to be the safest so we can move that into toxicology studies. And those studies need to be completed before we move this to the FDA, which then has to approve us to bring this into clinical trials. But I think we're on our way to something pretty big, and I think this will help many other patients as well. And we hope that you can help support our work, as I think this is going to help tremendously in our fight to knock out myeloma. Thank you.